Hey guys, it's Drek, and this is another one of those videos where if you see this come up in the comment section on my main videos, please link them to this video. Now, today we're going to be talking about something that other people have kind of touched on, but they're always very rude or very snooty about it. And I just want to like set the record straight, be very clear, as somebody who has like both a, a really good understanding of why Hasbro makes certain decisions, as well as like just a, a really firm background in this hobby. Let's talk about clips and magazines. And first off, like why we even have to talk about this on the channel at all, because um, people are rude and YouTube commenters are terrible and everybody wants to feel better than everybody else. And so they will look for virtually any minutiae to, to bicker about. And so um, the technicalities in firearms are actually quite simple. A magazine is something that holds rounds of ammunition and advances them up, whereas, or laterally or what have you, whereas a clip is something fixed that holds the ammunition in place and it moves with the ammunition through. And there are various ways to like splice and dice those definitions, but the big issue here, the reason that everybody gets so upset, is this is, I guess this, shoot, darn you flip clip. This is what Nerf calls a clip. And you see I just did it there inherently without thinking about it. This is a flip clip, this is a clip, they call this a, I think that they call these drums, they don't necessarily name them. The Rivals Round holders, they actually call magazines, which is interestingly correct. From a firearms perspective, this is a blaster parts banana clip or banana magazine, depending upon how you want to refer to it. And then, hilariously, this is a mag strike that I got while thrifting, and the mag strike has a magazine. Now, why is this confusing? Well, if you were just paying attention, those definitions don't exactly align. So if this was holding, say, like some ACP rounds or something, this would be a fully functioning magazine that pushed up rounds of live ammunition into a firearms chamber, got hit with a pin, and then flew out pew, and then were ejected the casing. So that's like, I have a very marginal understanding of firearms. I have been shooting at this point. And, and it was exciting and interesting and I learned a lot, but what I did learn is that people get really petty about this debate. So, uh, Nerf calls this a clip. Technically, it would be a magazine. That said, technically, it's really just whatever they want to call it. What does this do? It advances foam rounds, 50 caliber foam ammunition, into an air-powered plunger system that fires them through a barrel that doesn't even grip the darts. Like, this is whatever Hasbro wants to call it. If you are a crazy gun fanatic and you think that you will somehow feel better by correcting people who call it correctly a clip because that's what Hasbro calls it, what it's sold as, what it's marketed as, and what it's packaged as, if you think that you're going to get some feel goods by telling some child or other enthusiast that this is technically a magazine, then you're a curmudgeon. Like, let's, let's call a spade a spade. Like, you're an actual jerk. You, you took time out of your day to correct somebody who wasn't wrong on the internet in a YouTube comment section and then frequently these people come back and fight about it. Now, I don't mind that you come back and fight on my videos because frankly that's another view on the video and that's good for my channel, but it does bother me when you go out of your way to ruin somebody else's day. So like, if you're going to correct somebody, uh, don't for starters, because you're neither right nor wrong, just like they're neither right nor wrong, and just kind of be polite about it. Be like, if this was a firearm, it would be a magazine. I mean, this is a Nerf Electric Eel. Technically, the rounds advance through like so, and this would be a clip in a firearm capacity, but what it really is is a transparent piece of plastic that holds large mega-sized Nerf darts for a goofy blaster shaped like a marine creature. Like, that's the level of technicality that we could get to there. The mag strike has what would technically be a clip that advances via pneumatics, but I call them magazines because that's what Nerf calls them, and it goes in a mag strike. It even says so right there. So, like, the purpose of this video is not to correct people or really to educate people because I'm not pretentious enough to try and do that. Like, you can call your foam dart holding and actuating apparati, apparati, apparatuses, whatever. You can call them whatever you please and whatever makes you happy, but like if somebody 
in a Nerf engagement tells me to throw them a magazine or if I ask somebody to hand me a clip, I think that the overarching premise there is that everybody knows what everybody means and you should just like be a decent person about it. So in the great debate of Nerf clip or drum or clip versus magazine, ultimately it doesn't matter. Call your toys what you want to call your toys and don't think that because you're some hothead in the YouTube comments section that you have any right to correct somebody else for calling their toys what they want to call their toys. Thanks for watching.